All right, everybody, read, write for Google. Um, thanks to Jenny Abel, our Director of Student Services. We have a great tool in our district for everyone to have access to a wide variety of accessibility tools. Um, everything from speech to text, text to speech, screen readers, audio makers, translation, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, it's usually represented by this purple puzzle piece. Uh, it says RW. It is in your extension browser. That's usually how most students will access it. It is on their Chromebook as well as a separate app. Um, but this, the read write puzzle piece works closely with the screenshot reader, which is represented by a little kind of character with a pointy nose. Um, we usually do this training as the read, write, and Google Translate training. Um, but in this playlist, we're sort of going to walk through some of the features of Google Translate um, and, and read, write for Google. So uh, first, just kind of understanding that these accessibility features are for everyone. Um, everyone needs to have the ability to read and understand what's going on in order to participate um, in any uh, society or class. So uh, these accessibility features are there for everyone so that everyone can have a chance, including teachers, if you want, to um, open up doors and kind of have the ability to be part of the conversation. Um, the links that are on this page, if you want to see this presentation, it is in our um, Fostoria City Schools digital learning playbook. But the general gist is um, it was a family guy clip um, talking about uh, learning to read and the importance of it. And then this is Kendrick Lamar, um, where Kendrick Lamar was a Pulitzer Prize winning um, rapper. And it was the link uh, also allowed you to follow on, along to uh, a uh, study of the amount of words that um, rap music and music in general can hold. Um, understanding those words is part of the, the process of learning. So this read write extension is a, is a great tool. Um, there's three basic tools, read write, which is the main extension, screenshot reader, and then text help PDF viewer. Um, this is an uh, optional add on. But since we have Cami, uh, which is also a PDF reader, um, they can conflict with each other if they're forced onto everybody's computer. So it's sort of um, uh, a choice. Every PDF can open in text help or it could open in Cami. Um, so the goals, uh, we basically are going to try and walk you through the tools here uh, of the read write for Google. And I'm going to show you mainly how it works on a website and how it works on a Google Doc. So as the playlist goes on, we're going to go through the tools.